Hello everyone, welcome to our online class. Standard 7 Subject Science Lesson number 11 Cell Structure and Microorganism What is the name of the minute component of which the body of a living organism is made? Is the number of the smallest units the same in the bodies of all the living organism? The body of all living organism is made up of minute component called cell. The number of cells are different and specific for every living organism. We have learned that cellular organism is the primary characteristic of all the living organism and that the cell is the fundamental structural and functional unit of a living organism. We see that structural organization of a book in the above flow chart. Similarly, that are organizational label in the living organism too. There are cells, tissues, organs, organ system, organism. Cells form the basis of structure and the function of all living organism. It is the only with the help of the cells that living organism carry out all the different life processes. Where do the life processes of unicellular organism take place? All the life processes of unicellular organisms take place in a single cell. Their feeding, digestion, excretion all take place through one cell. During reproduction, the same cell is divided into two. Measurement and observation of cell In 1673, Anton van Leeuwenhoek assembled various lenses to construct a microscope. He was the first to observe live bacterial and protozoan cell under the microscope. Cells are extremely minute in size. We cannot see cells with the naked eye. Micrometer and nanometer are the unit used for measuring their size. The compound microscope is used for observing cells. An object on a glass slide magnifies many times by lenses of this microscope. 1 cm is equal to 10 mm, 1 mm is equal to 1000 micrometers and 1 micrometer is equal to 1000 nanometers. Let's try this. Take a piece segment of onion and carefully separate the thin skin from its concave surface with the help of a foresca. Place the membrane on a glass slide and put a drop of water on it. Take care that the membrane does not get folded while placing on the slide. Put a drop of a dilute solution of iodine or eosine over it and observe under the tear into objectives of the compound microscope. Don't forget to put a cover slip over the onion skin on the slide before placing it under the microscope. In the same way, observe the cells from various parts of the plants like leaves, bark, root tips, etc. Do you remember the last year you had observed the amoeba and paramecium that are found in a water? Cell size. There is a great variation in the shapes of cells. Their shapes are mainly related to their function. Observe the cells of a different shapes shown. Below. Cells are of many different shapes. Example, circular, rod shape, columnar, spiral, oval, rectangular, etc. Each cell contains various components for, care for carrying out the life processes of the living organism. These components are called organelles. These organelles are studied in detail with the help of the electron microscope, which can magnify images up to 2, 2 into 10 raised to 9, 2 billion times their actual size. There are two main types of cells, animal cells and plant cells. These cells consist of various types of membrane-bound cells organelles. Plant cells have a definite shape due to the presence of cell wall around them. Besides, unlike animal cells, plant cells contain single large vacuole. All these cells are known as eukaryotic cells. Four parts of cell. The cell has four main parts. The cell wall, cell membrane and cell organelles. Cell wall. The cell wall is the outermost covering of a cell. It is present only in the plant cell. Plasma membrane, it is also called as cell membrane, is a kind of thin covering. It is extremely delicate and flexible. It is the outermost covering of animal cells. Cytoplasm, 
The liquid part in the cell present around the nucleus is called cytoplasm. It occupies the space between the plasma membrane and the nucleus. Cell organelles are scattered in the cytoplasm. Cell organelles. This, may, this mainly includes the nucleus, endoplasmic, reticulum, Golgi bodies, lysosomes, micro, mitochondria, cell organelles. This mainly includes the nucleus, endoplasmic, reticulum, Golgi bodies, lysosomes, mitochondria, vacuole, plastid, etc. Plant cell contain chloroplast. Cell organelles. The nucleus. The nucleus is the important organelles of the cell. There is a porous double membrane around it. The nucleus control all function of the cell. The endoplasmic reticulum is a spiraling net-like organelle. It functions is to make necessary changes in the proteins produced by ribosomes and send them to the Golgi bodies. The Golgi bodies are made up of several flat sacs. The function is to proper distribution of protein. Mitochondria and plastids are the organelles which double outer covering. As mitochondria produce energy, they are called the powerhouse of the cell. Lysosomes Spherical bag with enzymes. Its function is to destroy cell by lysis. Suicidal bags of the cell. Chloroplast in the plant cell carry out the function of the photosynthesis. Vacuole help them to throw out waste products of the cell. Vacuoles in the animal cells are small, whereas there is only one large vacuole in a plant cell. In our next video, we are going to study about microorganism, fermentation, antibiotics and vaccine, harmful microorganism, pathogen, disease producing microorganism. Thank you.